find sine 240 to find this we should follow this method c here we have 240 now you should check 240 lies between which two multiples of 180 what i mean is 240 lies between 180 and 360 this is 180 into 1 this is 180 into 2 between these two numbers 240 lies next now this number is close to which number this is close to 180 so 240 now should be written as 180 plus 60 so this will become sine in place of this we should write this one 180 plus 60 this is your step one next sign in place of 180 now i write 1 into 180 plus 60 next here we have 180 so sign is not going to change it will remain sign and inside we get this angle 60 now the question is will we get here plus or minus to answer that we should look at the number before 180 that is 1 and 1 is odd and all the odd multiples of 180 they lie in either in the second or in the third quadrant so now to select the quadrant we should look at this symbol here we have plus that means angle lies in the third quadrant and in the third quadrant sign is negative so we should put negative so negative sine 60 is root 3 by 2 this is our answer